Hi, I'm Dr. Shweta Goswami, Associate Director, Infertility Department. As an infertility specialist, uh, we see a lot of infertility on the rise today. As women, we're late in trying to conceive now, we're uh, de delaying our childbearing due to our careers or late marriages. And our lifestyle issues like the stress that we're all going through nowadays, the diet that we take, the urban lifestyles and probably the Western uh, lifestyles that we've adopted are somewhere to blame. So here I am to try and give you a few tips as to how it can help you conceive naturally. Uh, hopefully not having to see somebody like us to help you conceive. Press the bell icon on YouTube and don't miss another update. We should understand the science behind conception because uh, if we get that right, we understand what's the important time to try. Uh, what are the percentages of success that we're looking at every cycle? A lot of patients come in to us now and they've just been trying for say three months or six months and, and they're really freak, freaking out as to why is it the things are not working out for us. So we need to understand that things haven't changed. We probably want to define our life. We probably want to plan October babies, but that's not how nature works. We have to understand the most fertile man, the most fertile women, try and procreate together, the chances that we're looking at is about 20 to 25 percent, which means everything being perfectly all right, you stand in odds of about one in four or one in five of conceiving that very month. So we need to understand it, take, it can take you as well as about six months to a year to uh, help you get pregnant and that's perfectly normal. We need to understand that the egg development happens, it starts from second day of our menstrual cycle and around 13th, 14th day of the period for anybody with a regular cycle of about 28 to 30 days is when the egg would ovulate and that's the important time, what we call the fertile window, anything between day 10 to day 18 for a regular, uh, regular cycling women is the important time to try. So if you as a couple are now planning to try, please make sure there's no travel involved at that time. At least trying uh, naturally or having intercourse once in 48 hours is the dictum where it says that the sperm stay in the tract for about 48 to 72 hours. So if we plan at that time, it should help us conceive naturally. Before we see a doctor, we should understand some warning signals. Our cycles are uh, very irregular. If our tubes have been known to be inflamed or we've had some kind of a gynae surgery or a pelvic surgery prior to this, if husband has had a history of mums or any uh, surgery done in the groin area, then we should consult our doctor earlier, else six months should be a good time to go. Our age is a very, very important determinant as to what, how uh, easily it can be for us to conceive and that's actually one of the primary reasons why infertility per se is on the rise now. Not only the woman's age, but the man's age is also important, but the woman's age is the key determinant of what is our success rate per cycle cycle and therefore do we need medical help earlier. Our age is above 35, we should probably see a doctor sooner, anybody close to us, an infertility specialist or a gynecologist who can at least define that does everything look uh, broadly normal. Like I've explained, lifestyle and environmental factors play a big role. So it's kind of detoxing your body when you try to conceive uh, uh, on your own. So therefore, we have to take into account the stress that we're undergoing. If we can do yoga, meditation, uh, music, anything that we think can actually soothe our nerves, it helps us uh, conceive naturally in a better manner. Physical exercise, swimming, aerobics, abdominal exercises, gym, anything that you think would help you uh, lead a healthier lifestyle is very important. A diet which has low carbs, low fat, low junk food of course, and richer in minerals and antioxidants. So things like walnuts, almonds, flax seeds. They're extremely good nutrients to add in your diet when we are planning to conceive. Do take heart in the fact that it does take people anything up to three to six months or even up to a year. The term definition of infertility doesn't come into being till you've actually had and tried for proper 12 cycles. So let's take hope in that and uh, give it a shot. All the very best. Thank you.